This thing still work? Man, oh, <laughs> it's been a minute. What is going on, y'all, man? It is your boy, Fat Cat. Damn, I haven't said that in a long time. Man. Hey, listen, man. I'm still here. I'm still alive. Hey, decided to pick up this camera today for the first time in a very long time, man. So for you guys who uh, have been on my channel for the last couple years, man, welcome back. Yes, I am back. I'm not going to say I'm going to be very consistent, not just yet, but there is a lot of things I got going on today. And I wanted to pick up a camera and bring you guys along. For those of you guys who are just watching my channel for the first time, what is going on, man? Uh, this is a, a, a first video in a long hiatus. Uh, you know what I'm saying? The first video back, man. So let's, go, let's get it on, man. I got a lot of things to do today, man. I'm going to take you guys along with me. You know what I'm saying? First thing, first order is... I don't know if y'all can see back there, but I got some tires back there, man. So I got to put some new tires on the rear of this car, man, of Christine, man. So let's go ahead and get to it. Let's get it in. Hey, by the way, I need a new damn intro. Jeez, that intro is super basic and boring right now. Still a dope song. I love that song, but I got to get something in the works, man. So anyway, let's go, man. Let's get it. Let's get into the day. First agenda of the day, man. We're here at the Riverview. What is this? Riverview Tire, I think it's called. Rear view tire and auto service. Gotta get Christine, gotta get some new shoes in the back, man. You know what I'm saying? On her feet. Uh, uh, the rear tires, man, are pretty bad. So I'm gonna, once I take them off, I'm gonna show you guys how bad they are. I had the front, I did the front tires, man, a couple months ago, right here. Um, they always take care of me. So now I'm doing the rear tires real quick. Um, like I said, a few months later, it's probably about three months now that I've done the front tires. Now I gotta do the rears, uh, cause they're pretty bad, so. Got to make sure the shoes are right, man, because you got to make sure that safety is first. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, I'll show you guys how they look once um, they take them off real quick, man. But it shouldn't be long. They, like I said, man, you come here. If you're in the Riverview area or if you're in the, like, Tampa area, man, you come over here. And, um, bro, they pretty much get you in and out. Like, there's no wait. No, I don't got to make an appointment. I just come try to get here early as possible. They open up at 7 o'clock. I get here right at the time. They're not even picking up. There's no partnership, there's no, they're not paying me for nothing. I'm letting you guys know, every time I come here to take care of me, I come right in, I'm in and out in like 30, 45 minutes at the most, you know what I'm saying? And that's just, half of that time is when I'm figuring out how to jack the car up to make sure they don't mess nothing, mess nothing up, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, so these are the old ones right here, you see how, you can start seeing all the uh, duct line coming through, man, all the steel coming through, so definitely had to get new tires. And these are all worn down all the way through, man. So I know a lot of people are gonna be like, oh man, check your check your alignment, this and that. Look, these are worn down all the way through, all the way through. Yeah, it's a little bit worse here, but it's bad all the way around, man. So time for some new rubber. Alright, so we're dropping off Christine here. Uh at, at the grocery store, actually at the Publix, man. Got the new feet on the back, the new rubbers on the back, dropping her off. Now we gotta go over here, pick up the wife's car. Which is there, that's a big story about that one too, man. My wife's car right there. I gotta go inside and get the keys real quick because my son brought it to work. But now I gotta pick that up, drop that off at T-Fats because then needed a whole new cleaning and everything else, man, because that car was just in the shop for about a month or so because transmission went out. So that was five grand out the pocket right there. Five grand out the pocket. Anyway, we just got it back a couple weeks ago. But been trying to get in it with T-Fast, man. We're going to do that today, man. So let me go get the keys and we're going to drop that off at T-Fast. All right, so we are in the wife's car now. I um, wanted to take you guys, wanted to take quite, uh, time real quick to talk to you guys and let you guys know, man. It's not going to be this video because this video I got a lot of other stuff going on. So we're just going through the day. And if you guys already see the title of this video, um, you guys already know what it is, man, coming towards the end of this video. But, so we're not going to waste the time on it right now. But I will get to you guys and let you guys know why I've been on a hiatus why i've been away from the scene man why i stepped away from social media you know what i'm saying uh, a quick a quick uh uh look into it man basically i just been busy man i got you know i still i was you got if, for you guys have been following me for a while you guys know that i, I work it man um so I, i'm still doing my it thing and i also picked up another job man um that i'm working at night so i'm literally working two jobs right now 40 hours each you know what i'm saying and uh bro i'm just putting i'm just putting in a lot of work right now uh, because we got real life goals and not saying that you know social media is not real life you know what i'm saying but 
Um, you know, we got real life goals, man. You know what I'm saying? Or at least I got real life goals, man. To put my family in a situation, man. You know, that's, that's uh, you know, going to be better for them. Um, so, like I said, although the social media thing is cool and all and all that, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, you know, until you actually make it, you know, big, big, um, you know, it's not really that much money. You know what I'm saying? It's good supplemental. If you want to put it like that, but it's not really that much. You know what I'm saying? Just like maybe a couple grand here, a couple grand there, da da da. Like I said, it, you know, when you somebody like me who's already established and, and and pretty much in life, and you got kids, and you got this and that, and third, you know, a couple grand here, a couple grand there doesn't work. You know, we need I need actual like real, 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 real. You know, dividends, bills, dividends. You know, Benjamins and all that good stuff. <laughs> anyway. Regardless, man, I don't, all that stuff doesn't matter. But like I said, I'll break it down even further, um, you know, uh, uh, why I've been gone and everything else um, in another video, man. But right now, that's not for that. So let's go ahead and drop this. Let's go and drop this car off at T Fast, man, and keep moving from there. All right, man. So we just dropped off. Actually, you know, this car is called Dora, man. Dora the Explorer. <laughs> don't ask why. But anyway, the wife's car. We here at T Fats now, man. You already know T Fats, man. T Fats. Auto spy, you know what I'm saying? Got the guys out here already working on one car. Then they're gonna bring that one, bring hers in later on after that to get that one back up and running, man. So yeah, and, 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 and we we taking care of business, man. So T, TJ even got to take me back to my car. We just got so much going on, man. Specialty treatment. Ah, oh, appreciate I didn't you. Know how? <laughs> but I didn't know how. <laughs> hey, listen, man. Hey, don't ask for it. Yeah, 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 right, right, right. All right, man. Hey, so we gonna get back with y'all in a second. I'm about to ride in this in the bench real quick. Let me find oh, out. Hey man, so like the man said, man, don't ask for this treatment, man. But you know, I've been, you know, we 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 have been rocking for a couple years now, so you know what I'm saying. I gotta bring the cars to him, but the wife was busy, so I couldn't. She couldn't come with. Oh, it was a whole bunch of stuff, man. So we got a lot of things moving and grooving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This way, we got a lot of things moving and grooving, man. So I had to make sure I dropped the car off. He gotta bring me back to my car because I gotta go do something else. As you guys can see at the end of this video. But uh, hey, I had to, I didn't pick up this camera in a minute, so I gotta get him on camera, man. TJ, let him know what's everything up? about what's going on man. with T Fats, man. Come on, it's been a while. It's yeah. been a while, man. We've been uh, we've been staying very consistent to the best that we can. Um, as we know, adversity and all of these things going on out here right now, you know, it's uh, it's really a big time that I always tell my team is how do we block out as much noise as possible? Exactly, because. The ingredients and the sauce and what we delivering didn't change. Right. You know, like we're still going for the best possible outcome in every situation. Right. But because of all the other circumstances out here, you know, things can get cloudy. So we're really, really, you know, focused on consistency and, 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 and handling the adversity that does get thrown because there's just so many things out here being right. thrown right now. Right. So you know, we're staying active, the studio is growing, and um, you know, our mobile team is doing a great job out there, taking care of people real professional as we come you to the they, they come check, they come do, they come do Christine every other week, man, yeah, on, man. you know what I'm saying, every every Friday, or every other Friday, I should say, on, you know, like it's clockwork, so right. definitely the street team is doing their thing. Man, they're doing, they're doing a fabulous job, right. and, and we've got our other unit ready to go, so we're, we're still, we are hiring. Um, and I'm looking for great individuals, honestly, that, that, that they don't have to be like us. They don't gotta be like me. We just wanna have the same vision as everybody. Yeah, exactly, you know? right, right. Quality, entertainment, have fun doing what we do, and right. uh, you know, really rewrite the narrative, which is what we came in this game for, is we came in to this auto detailing industry to rewrite the narrative and, and show a class A act. You know what's funny that you mentioned that because I don't think we've ever told the people. I think I might have mentioned a couple times, but how did you get into this business? Like, yeah. like, and, 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 and as much as you want to share, but tell them what you was doing before. Yeah. And you know, what I'm saying how you got into this business. Yeah. You know, I was blessed, and I, I played at the highest level in the professional football game you could ever imagine. You know, I played in the NFL. I did two and a half seasons. I did completely three years. And, you know, I, I I was able to be institutionalized in a system that honestly was about standard structure, you know, 100% effort every day. Wait, hold on, let me cut you off. I gotta cut him off real quick, because let me tell you something. Yo, 
Because we've heard this story before from some other individuals on social media. But you can't never find him anywhere. <laughs> Listen, if you Google this man, he's going to come up. You're going to see him in a uniform, <laughs> in a help. You know what I'm saying? You're going to see him in a full get up. Like, he was there. You know what I'm saying? We, we, well, he was. <laughs> I, I've had that. Well, look, listen. I'm not going to mention no names, but we've had in the past that, yeah, I play for this, I play for that, da da da. And then you look him up, you know where to be found. You be like, hold on. You know what I'm saying? But, anyways, Story. hey, listen. Neither here nor there. You look at, you you, you Google his name, you're going to see him for real, for real, pull up <laughs> on that, man. So he was yeah, man. he was right here in Tampa, too, man. Yes, to sir. Bucket is. I'm sorry. No. Continue, sir. Little cat, no, no problem, man. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. And, 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 and having that opportunity, though, you know, to segue into why we are in this industry now right. was truly the fact that, you know, I wanted to come in and start a business that was like a team, you know, like, this business here, I didn't come in it to be a detailer and detail a thousand and one clients right. by myself. I, I mean, there, there, there's no fun in that at the end of the day. Right. You know, I, I came in it to be able to have a team type experience, uh, have, have levels of understanding, have right. levels of where we're trying to go to, and and more than anything, you think about the NFL and you think about these high professional sports. There's an attachment to it to to you know the viewers. Right. Right. In our case an attachment to our clients. Clients, exactly. So, so we have to make sure that we're cultivating this full-blown experience at all times. And that's what I really wanted to enjoy in this thing. You know, it's like, how do I create an experience that my clients and the people that we deal with feel uh, absolutely amazing? And then on top of that, can I change the narrative of how guys in this industry are? Right. Because, you know, you think about, those are just car wash guys. Right. Those are just detail guys. Right. Like, that's not my team. And, we have meetings and I tell guys, look, listen, we are trying to station ourselves in a whole different manner so that way the respect behind what you do can one be emphasized, you see what I'm saying? So like you, you, the, the dedication of, like it was for me in the NFL, waking up and going to work out every day, right. it's the same dedication that these guys the next days, by come way. in and they've got to be ready to do the same thing they did yesterday, again today, today. at 100% rate. Exactly. There's no difference. Right. You got to put in the work every day. Every day. Right. And so being able to been exposed to that to that NFL and, and to that type of life, you know, I think has been a very much of a huge transition to, to what has helped my transition. And although it was freaking crazy hard to get started because I don't know any business. From How long you actually been doing this right now? Uh, right? Man, we've been a business five years. Five years. Five years. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Because most businesses fail. Years, in that first year. In the first year, they make it to maybe the third year, you know, and, and we dealt with COVID and we right. dealt with, um, we dealt with just people shortage of you know, people wanting to come in. It's, it's just, a, just a lot. We'll be right back. <laughs> Are you gonna answer that? No, we're good. Oh, okay. We're good. Well, nah, but it's true though. And now that you're saying that, you know what I'm saying? Like you was, so you was actually kind of, still, I mean, you still in your infancy, but you was really, really, yeah, you know what I'm saying, like in your infancy when the COVID hit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Within yeah. the first couple of years yeah. of your business starting. So I know right. you know what I'm saying, without without that, um, without that vision, without that fortitude, without that that passion, that drive, you know what I'm saying? You could have easily folded. Yeah, yeah you, know. you know what I'm saying? So yeah. so Every, congratulations that you actually you, you know what I'm saying, uh stuck it through, man. And like I said, you guys are doing, you know, uh uh you know, I, I wonders right now. I appreciate it. And, and, and I'm gonna tell you this, man, you know what I'm saying? You know, and, and look, like you said, man, it's, it's it's more than just a car wash. It's not just car wash guys or whatever, or, or the experience, like I said, that they doing. I'm out here for you guys, right? We're making a right. Um, so, uh, put it like this, man. So people at my job, like I said, they come take care of my car every every other Friday, right? And people at my job is like, man, you know, they always ask, what's the price? What's the price? And I tell them, you know what I'm saying, what the price is. It's not a regular car wash. So the first thing they say is, man, I don't, you know, that's kind of expensive. I'm like, well, look. You know, these these guys are not just throwing water in your car and, you know what I'm saying, and drying it off. Like, they, they actually, it's in a whole experience. And on top of that, just your, what, what you would call your regular car wash for them is, is it's, a detail. It's, it's a detail. You know what I'm saying? Like, they're going to go way further and beyond than what your normal car wash is. You know what I'm saying? So, they're not just throwing water in your car, you know, throwing a little bit of soap on the sponge and, and taking it off. And that's it. Like, like, these guys, like. I remember the first time I was like, I remember the first time I was like, I was like, hold on. I was like, you, you got a brush in my lug nuts? Like, hold on, what, what am I paying for? Like, hold on, I just need a regular. He was like, nah, that's included. included. That's included. That's, yeah, just, that's your regular, that's the lowest yeah. 
yeah, package you could get. It's so funny. They take a brush that. to the lug nuts. Come it's, on, man. It's because I, I think here's that thing with me being in the league. It's like when they're like, okay, we've got a you got 20, 110 yard sprints today. Right. You got 20. <laughs> um, you're going to get the 19, and we're going to run 19 just like you ran number one. Right, exactly. <laughs> you better, or you better, and I understand, you know what I'm saying, that sometimes you may not, you know, your body may not give it, but you, you, but you got to give that effort. So, every so, day, so every that, time. That, that creates this muscle and this, and this, and this mindset and this paradigm right. that makes that the average isn't just good enough right you know and I think sometimes that's even hard on guys that we bring in because it's it, it is about setting that standard and that structure exactly. to the point where it's like you become an irreplaceable guy for that client because they're like no one's gonna really care about my car or my possession which for one we all know the Vago is your second biggest investment right right home. right so it's just not a small thing you know you can have whatever kind of car in the world Honest to goodness, it was an expense for you. So treating it right is very important, and the people that are doing it need to have the right mindset, you know. And and that's really kind of where we challenge ourselves. And this is just a challenge to ourselves and to our team. And if it spills into doing great service, we win on both sides. Hundred percent, man. Hey, one more time, man. Tell them where they can find you. Tfatsautospot.com. Tfatsautospot. Social media. You guys. Check us out on Google. Um, honestly, reach out. Like I said, we're always in the in this thing to grow. I love being around business-minded individuals and people and people that want to see growth and just want to see people do good. You know, um, it's 2022, man. You know, we're looking for peace. We're looking for for patience, and, and most importantly, you know, we keep prayer on top of it all. So let's keep taking care of everybody in this world, man. One step at a time. Yes, sir. Don't forget about that prosperity. Yes, sir, man. The energy flows where the yes, mind sir. goes. Keep yes, your sir. mind right. And uh, TFATS Auto Spa is doing our part in this community to make sure everybody stays happy with us. Hey, man. Yo, man come on, man. Y'all ain't know y'all was about to catch a sermon today. Come on, man. <laughs> y'all ain't know all that. Come on, man. Hey, yo, if y'all, look, I know it's been a minute, but if y'all know a fat cat video, man, y'all gonna get a little bit of everything. You know it. So, hey, TJ, man, one more Thanks, time, bro. man. Thanks, bro. I'm about to shut off this camera cool. about to. I'm about to get back to Christine real quick. <laughs> And uh, I gotta talk some business with him real quick. Yes, and then, uh, you know what I'm saying? But we get back to y'all. So, TFAST Auto Spot, man, y'all know it's gonna be in the description. Make it right here. Yes, sir. Make, it's gonna be all in the description. So, uh, make sure y'all check them out, man. Let them know Fat Cat sent you. You know what I'm saying? You know it. You know it. Man, guys, so I just came over to the dealership. They had a, a Volkswagen GTI at this particular dealership, about an hour from my house. And they must have sold. I talked to them last night around six o'clock. They said, yep, they got the car. Um, you know, I made an appointment for this morning at 11. I actually came a little an hour early at 10 and it's sold. So it is what it is. But they did give me hundred dollars worth of gift cards for gas. So can't complain with that. But speaking of that though, look at this dope Ford GT. Look at that Ford GT sitting nice. That thing is nasty. Mm, mm, mm. All right, y'all, man. So, hey, it is a whole nother day. I'm at a different place, man, because the dealership did not have it. So, I had to come to one of these. <laughs> Buy here, pay here. Um, but it's all good, man. I looked at this car, man. It looks pretty good. I got my son a car, man. So, check it out right here, man. Look at this coming down. This is the guy that helped me right there, man. Ronnie, man, good guy, man. Uh, you know, it was a straightforward deal, man. And, uh, you know, we didn't have, you know, uh, uh, too many discrepancies. And that was that, man. Real good people right here at Easy Choice. Thank you. Uh, what is the Easy Choice Auto Sales, right? Easy Choice Auto Yeah, make sure you guys come check them out. Give me your phone number just in case you want to check it out. 313-597-7001. There you go, man. So, deal with Ronnie. Ask for Ronnie. Let him know that Fat Cat sent you. You know, get you guys a good deal, man. Like I said, this came out to be a, a pretty good deal. I'll, I'll break it down everything that how much I got it for last time or how much I got it for but First things first we're going to take this over to TFAS Auto Spa to get it cleaned up uh, You know what I'm saying because we got to make sure we present this so it's going to be a whole different video as far as 
uh, you know, presenting it to my son and all that. But man, check out the interior real quick. Everything looks good, man. It's flawless. It's got the sunroof and everything. So, everything looks good. Can't complain. Super clean in the back. Look at this. Like I said, I really don't like to do, you know, buy here, pay here that often. Honestly, I really don't like, you know, I like to go to regular dealerships. But the dealerships, I couldn't find anything. So, I found this online, man, and I came over here, and it looks pretty good. Like I said, I can't complain. You know what I'm saying? There's a few flaws here and there. But at the end of the day, you know, it is what it is. I got a really good deal on it. So we're going to go ahead and move on, man. Take this t fast, get it all cleaned up. So in the next video, we're going to surprise my son, man. Other than that, man, that's all I got for y'all today. Appreciate y'all for checking me out. It's been a long time. I am back, kind of. Not 100%, but I'm back a little bit. And, uh, you know, we're going to keep things moving, man. So, hey, stay humble, stay blessed, stay motivated, all that good stuff, man. I forget what I used to say months and months ago. But you guys know what it is, man. Make sure you uh, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, man. I check you guys out on the next one, man. We out of here later.